Hi buddies, hope you're doing fine. In this series, we will discuss about the important one words from the Romantic Age. If you are ready, let's get started. The Romantic Age. Why is the year 1798 taken to be the year of the beginning of the Romantic Movement? Because it was the year in which Wordsworth Lyrical Ballads was published. Who was the authors of the Lyrical Ballads? Wordsworth and Coleridge. Wordsworth prelude is an autobiographical poem. We are laid asleep in body and become a living soul. In which poem of Wordsworth does this line occur? Tintin Abbey. Collins' poem In Yonder Grave a Druid Lies is an elegy on the death of James Thompson. In Nightmare Abbey, Thomas Love Peacock, Satyrs, Shelley and Coleridge. Who is the author of the four ages of poetry? Thomas Love Peacock. To which poet does the phrase willing suspension of disbelief applies to Coleridge? But Europe at the time was thrilled with joy, France standing on the top of golden hours and human nature seeming born again. Which time is worth worth referring to in these lines? The period of French Revolution. Bliss was it in that dawn to be alive, but to be in was very heaven. This line occurs in Wordsworth, the prelude. Hill like a city, much like London. Whose view is this? Shelley. Who was the intellectual father of the French Revolution? Rousseau. The mariner in the ancient mariner kills an albatross. O oh lady, we receive, but what we give and in our life alone does nature live. Who is the lady Wordsworth addresses in these lines? Dorothy Wordsworth, his sister. Robert Sade's A Vision of Judgment is a ludicrous eulogy of George II. Shelley was expelled from the Oxford University for the publication of On the Necessity of Atheism. Who was the poet who worked one morning and found himself famous? Lord Byron. Who called Shelley an ineffectual angel beating in the void his luminous wings in vain? Matthew Arnold. Name the novelist whose novels are Waverly novels. Walter Scott. Elia is the pen name assumed by Charles Lamb. Shelley's Defense of poetry is a rejoinder to Thomas Love Peacock's The Four Ages of Poetry. Madeline is the heroine of the narrative poem of Keats title Eve of St. Agnes, who said about himself, My name is writ in waters. Keats, who said, I have a smack of Hamlet myself. Coleridge, Shelley's death was caused by drowning. Nothing to him that doth fade, but doth suffer a sea change into something rich and strange. Those lines from Ariel's song were inscribed upon the grave of one of the following poets, Shelley. Life like a dome of many colored grass strains the wide radiance of eternity until death tramples it to fragments die. From which poem are the above lines quoted? Shelley's Adonis. One of Keats' odes hangs with the line, Forever with thou love and she be fair. Name the ode. Ode on a Grecian urn. A thing of beauty is a joy forever. A verse tale of Keats begins with this line, Identify the tale, Endymion. We look before and after and pine for what is not in which of Shelley's lyrics to these lines occurs to a sky log. He prayeth best, who loveth best, all things great and small. In which poem do these lines occur? The rhyme of the ancient mariner. Who is the author of Life of Scott? John Lockhart. Who is the author of Confession of an English Opium Eater? Thomas D. Quincy. Who has written tales from Shakespeare? Charles Lamb. The author of Biographia Literaria is Coleridge, who is considered to be the most remarkable historical novelist of the Romantic period, Walter Scott. Edinburgh Review was found in the year 1802. The severe criticism of Endymion, which is believed to have has in he Keats' death, appeared in the Quarterly Review. 
Referring to Adonis, Shelley said, I have dipped my pen is consuming fire for his destroyers. Who were these destroyers? The editors of both the Quarterly Review and the Backwood magazine. After whom did Wordsworth become the poet laureate of England? Robert Sade. After whose refusal the poet laureate ship was uh, confused on Robert Sade. Walter Scott. Charles Lamb wrote play The Good Nature Man. Why is the year 1837 taken as the dozing year of the Romantic period and beginning of the Victorian age? Because Tennyson came into prominence in this year. Theodore Watts Dunton gives the title The Renaissance of Wonder to the Romantic period. Who gave the slogan back to nature? Rosao. Who says the romantic moment was the expression of individual genius rather than the established rules? W. J. Long. The phrase the high road of life was used by Coleridge. The open warfare between England and France took place in the year 1793. Who is the last leader in Browning's poem? The last leader. Wordsworth. Tintin away and intimations of immorality are two famous poems by Wordsworth. S.T. Coleridge produced a play, Remorse in the Year, 1813. Byron's The Vision of Judgment is a political satire. Shellist, The Witch of Atlas, which was written in 1820, was published in the year 1824. Thomas More's Life of Byron appeared in the year 1824. Thomas Love Peacock's satirical novel Nightmare Abbey came out in the year 1818. Jane Austen's Northanger Abbey, which was written in the year 1798, was published in the year 1818. Lodgin is a piece of poetic work by Scott. Lodgin has been taken from the larger poetic work Mormon 1808. Caleb's In Search for Wife is a novel by Hannah Moore. Peter Lou Mazoka took place in the year 1819. Peninsula War began in 1808. Byron's English Bots and Scotch Reviewers is about survey of English poetry and contemporary scene. Who said Byron was mad, bad and dangerous to know? Lady Lamb. Who said about Wordsworth? His poetry is the reality, his philosophy is illusion. Arnold. Who wrote? Frankenstein, Mary Shelley. Madurin's Melmoth, The Wanderer, is a Gothic novel. Sibyl, a novel, is a powerful exposure to the abuses related to capital and labor. Who wrote it? Mrs. Gaskell. Wordsworth, The Borderers, is a blank verse tragedy. Who wrote? A poet is a nightingale who sits in darkness and sings to cheer its own solitude with sweet sounds. Byron. Table Talk is an essay on Shakespeare by Coleridge. Scott's The Antiquity was written in the year 1816. Who said about Scott that he cannot construct and he has a trivial mind and a heavy style? E. M. Foster. Shellist The Sensi is a tragedy. Who ma married Mary Wollstonecraft? Shelley. Godwin's second novel, Saint Leon, came out in the year 1799. The Times under the name of the Daily Universal Register was brought out by John Walter. Wordsworth, the prelude which was completed in 1805, was published in the year 1850. The prelude has been divided into 14 books. The Great Auto Dejection was written by Coleridge. Byron directed a satire mainly against Sade, who said, if winter comes, can spring be far behind? Shelley, who said, first in beauty shall be first in might? Keats. Thomas Campbell's Jetrod of Wyoming is a tale of Pennsylvania. Which novel of James Cooper deals with the sea? The pilot. Whose biography did Walter Scott write? Napoleon. Life of Walter Scott was written by John Lockhart. Mr. Rochester is a character in the novel Jane Eyre. Godwin's third novel, Fleetwood, came out in the year 1801. 
ஜெய்ன் ஆஸ்டன்ஸ் எம்மா வாஸ் ரிட்டன் இன் த இயர் எயிட்டீன் சிக்ஸ்டீன் நியூஸ் ஃப்ரம் நோ வார் இஸ் அ ட்ரீம் அலிகரி பை வில்லியம் மோரிஸ் வால்டர் ஸ்காட்ஸ் நாவல் ராப் ராய் கேம் அவுட் இன் த இயர் எயிட்டீன் செவன்டீன் எஸ்ஐஸ் ஆன் எஜுகேஷன் மேனர்ஸ் அண்ட் லிட்ரேச்சர் வாஸ் ரிட்டன் பை வில்லியம் காட்வின் காட்வின்ஸ் லைஃப் ஆஃப் சார்ஸ் அப்பியர்ட் இன் த இயர் எயிட்டீன் நாட் த்ரீ த நம்பர் ஆஃப் லெக்சர்ஸ் டெலிவர் பை கால்டர் ஜான் ஷேக்ஸ்பியர் இஸ் ஃபார்ட்டி த்ரீ விச் பிளே வாஸ் நாட் டிஸ்கஸ் பை கால்டர்ஜ் கிங் லியர் Guy Mannering is a novel by Walter Scott who said that Scott has neither artistic detachment nor passion for stir who is not influenced by William Godwin Coleridge which book was inspired by the French Revolution the inquiry concerning political justice William Godwin brought out his inquiry concerning political justice in the year 1793 thank you so much for watching this video till end if you are having any suggestion let me know in the comment section we'll see you in next video tata bye bye